Okay, welcome to my CNC closet. This is uh, Shapeoko and is hooked up by USB over here to a Raspberry Pi, which is sitting here as part of this uh, hack top. So what you're seeing here is Epiphany browser running uh, easel. Notice that the 3D view doesn't work. That's okay, um, because the 2D view does work. If we go here and select something, notice we can change settings, we can move things around. All the 2D stuff actually works fine here. And then what we can do is go to machine, select advanced, and let's generate some G-code. This is gonna take a little bit, but notice that it is working. And you can see that our CPU has completely maxed out. And it's gonna sit here for a while and we'll be back in a second, okay? Do uh, you see the G-code just finished uh, being generated? Now let's go over here and hit export G-code. Well, it's going to take a little bit. And so you can see here, we have gone ahead and maxed out the CPU again. And it's going to sit here and wait for a little bit. Back in a second. So exporting G-code actually takes a little bit longer than generating G-code. But when it's done, this new tab shows up. Uh, and this has all of your G-code on it. So just go over here. An epiphany and select save as things are slow because well it's slow it's a raspberry pi so let's just call this i'm just going to copy over an existing file which is fine but you need to make sure it's named dot nc so call whatever you want dot nc saves and then we can go ahead and skip over to, this is a Gerbil controller. I use it to, to actually send the G code. So let's connect up to this Shapoko. And in a second here, should true connect. There we go. I'll hook up to the Shapoko. And here's the NC file we just created, load it up. And there you go, there's a squirrel. And let's just do like a little air cut so you can sort of see that the Shipako actually does do this. So here we go. Here's the Shipoko moving, pretending it's gonna cut my squirrel out. That's it. That's a Raspberry Pi driving a Shapoko and running uh, uh, Easel on Epiphany.